What's up guys, Skull here, and today we are back for another Rust update video. So, this is not fully covering the dev blog 80, wait no, dev blog 90. Um, because really nothing else was really important at the moment to me, personally. However, it's a lot of bug fixes and stuff, but there has been one major change to the game, and that is bed and sleeping bad mechanics. So, if you guys haven't read the dev blog, Beds can be placed, or sleeping bags, they can be placed within 50 meters of each other. However, they all have the same cooldown if they're all within 50 meters. So I have went ahead and tested to see how long was 50 meters. As you guys can see, I've tested this a few times. Um, a bunch of suiciding and stuff, and I finally came to a conclusion. Okay, so beds on the same floor. If you want to respawn on different cooldowns, you're going to need a foundation length of 18. And, um, yeah, so 18 horizontally on the same floor is enough to go ahead and give you a different cooldown. So, in case you guys don't believe me, let me go ahead and suicide. Oh. And then we will respawn at the 18 foundation mark. And if we suicide again, we can spawn on the starting line, which is this bag over here. So I did a little bit of math, and turns out 15, I mean, 18 divided by 50 is like uh, 2.78. I, th I think that's something like that. So each foundation or wall, because I also did it horizontally and I got the same result. So each wall is 2.78 meters tall, and each foundation is 2.78 meters long. And just in case if you guys don't believe the change, here you go. I will I will spawn on the 18 on this one as well, and I can also spawn on this one. The 17 won't let me because they were right beside each other, and I can spawn on the ground floor, and boom. So yeah, that's pretty much it. Um, this is worst case scenario. I'm not sure if you spread them out all, all along your base. Like one will be over here, one will be all the way down here over here. It, it, it'll be different. It varies, but this is the absolute worst case scenario. So yeah, if you guys enjoyed the video, please be sure to hit like, and I will see you guys in the next update.